What's up, sports bettors? U.S. Open lines are flying around, and I just zoned in on a really good positive EV play that I'm going to share with you. So I locked it in for 285 bucks, as you can see right here. It's Carlos minus nine and a half on the game spread. And you can see there were some bets on the total games market as well. But this one I just absolutely loved, right? So I like this bet for a bunch of reasons. But you can see he's minus nine and a half on the game spread. He's a huge favorite, right, in this tennis match. And then this is your profit margin for Mods Jam. So 4.92%. So essentially, we're staking 285, you know, which you can see right here, 285 bucks, 4.92% um, profit margin. So our bet has $14 in profit, right? So you couldn't even give me a $10 bill. I wouldn't trade you this bet, right? This bet is very strong mathematically. And if you just take a look at the odds, it should be pretty clear how ridiculous the value in this play is, right? DraftKings is pricing this at minus 160. WinBet's pricing this at minus 150. And then you get Pinnacle, which is the sharpest sports book in the world, pricing this at minus 131. And they all have the, you know, Carlos heavily favored because lines have been moving towards him. Now, FanDuel, they're giving you the same price on the minus nine and a half for Carlos and then Federico plus nine and a half at minus 114 as well. So they're not juicing the market in either direction. Whereas every sports book aside from FanDuel is. So as a rational sports better, right, we're just like, oh, wow, this minus nine and a half looks like an insane discrepancy. That's a bet we should take advantage of, which is exactly what I did. And that's exactly what Odds Jam does for you, right? It's pretty simple. It literally just constantly scans all of these markets in real time, updating the odds to try to, fi to, try to find you, you know, these big line discrepancies where you actually have the mathematical edge, such as Carlos Alcaraz minus nine and a half on the game spread. And then it's just your job to place as many sharp, profitable bets kind of as you can on a daily basis, which you can see I do every single day because this bet has 14 bucks in profit margin. So if we place 10 of them that all have 4.92% profit margin, we have $140 in profit margin. And we're reducing our variance because we're placing more bets with an edge. So more bets actually reduces your variance, which is quite interesting. So another way you can think about it is let's say, you know, your average bet has 4.92% EV in your unit size. So bet size, let's just say everything you bet is $75 and you're placing bets with 4.92% profit margins, right? So what's so fascinating about sports betting and the reason it can be profitable is you have to remember like we're getting this return in less than 12 hours, right? Which is really powerful because it's not like you wait a year on an investment or something like that. This is a 4.92% return that you earn in a day, less than a day, 12 hours. So we're earning, you know, so let's say you're betting $75 unit. You have a 4.92% EV on average on your bet. And you want to earn, let's just say $1,250 per month betting on sports. What this will tell you is, hey, each of your bets has 369 in mathematical profit margin, you know, edge as it's called. So you need to place 338 bets in a month, which is 11 bets per day to earn $1,250 sports betting per month. So now it's just your job to use Odds Jam to place that many bets. It's really that simple. You place enough bets with an edge, you're literally statistically guaranteed to make money. Um, and also by definition, right, one of these bets has to be profitable. You could ARB this minus 114 with this plus 135 or this plus 120, right? On FanDuel, you only need to bet 114 to win 100 on Carlos minus nine and a half. On DraftKings, you're betting 100 to win 135 in profit on Federico plus nine and a half. So this is an arbitrage bet. And arbitrage bets, again, are just opportunities where you can learn about them, you know, kind of on Odds Jam, just hit this little help button. And there's some great information on this is how you can make risk-free money sports betting due to discrepancies in sportsbook odds. And again, all of these things are quite rare if you think about it. Like FanDuel has, you know, millions of odds on its site. Most bets are very unprofitable, very, very unprofitable. But there's a rare amount of bets, you know, 0 0.1, 0 0.2, 0 0.01% of bets at a time. As you can see, it's a very small percentage still, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 
right? So there's eight bets right now where you can make risk-free money in the sports betting market in Arizona. So it's not that many out of the millions of odds on sports books. And Odds Jam's just, you know, constantly scanning all of these odds in real time to try to find you these discrepancies where you can make risk-free profits and actually have the edge as a sports better. Um, so anyways, that's the bet I have. Let's make some money.